Hey kids. Hope you all had a good day. My day is just starting. You know how I told you the regions on where we go? We've been doing this so long that there are certain areas that you know, we call leakers. We're, we're going one of them today. It's in Washingtonville. It's like a little uh, condo complex. They all leak. Every single one of them, they leak. But they're guaranteeing us that theirs doesn't. So, I think most of the others did also. It's hard to get excited for going to a place where at some point in time, stuff's gonna get shitty. But, you know, we'll rise above. Craig is in already. Corey and Mike and Sam, they're on their way. Trying to get yesterday's customer. What a good guy he was covered. Um, he's not gonna have coverage. He doesn't have a good carrier. And that's it for now. Nothing earth shattering for me to tell you, Pete. I'm sorry I screwed up your last name on your business. But Craig didn't set me up to fail, uh, to pay, to win on that, succeed. So let me just blame him. It makes it easy. It's always easy to point fingers, right? No, it's his fault. We'll pack up, load up. You know the deal. Head to Washingtonville, and then give my new customer terrible news. We'll see you out there. All right, so we have reached Washingtonville. Craig? Yes, sir. We're trying to make a decision whether the 26,000 pound 10 year old dump truck is gonna make it up there. What'd you say? I say the front's gonna slam into that a little bit. Yeah. Let's squail it in. It's just down a squail? Squail. Let's squail it Let's in. Squail it in. Let's squail it in. Where's the, I mean, yeah, that's the, the neighbor's property. We can't go in over there, but we can make that definitely. Oh, nice. <laughs> huh? They seem nice people. Well, it's a good way for us to introduce ourselves to them. <laughs> Give them a $100 coupon off and then destroy their lawn. Yeah, this is not feeling confident. Neither are you, right? No. Right? But 90% of the tanks leak back. Yeah, we're in Washingtonville where they all leak, so why don't we stick it for water first? Oh, you just want a $100 challenge. Mikey needs it. We all need it. Good. It's an easy job. We'll track up here in the back. And the tank's right there. You can tell the way it lies. And he wants the new tank right here. We'll trench over. We'll grab those lines. And we'll tie into them. Because that's what he asked. And that's it, kids. Tank Masters at it again. But we all feel that this is gonna leak. We'll do a uh, $100 challenge. Go get the water detecting paste. Being done. What time is inspection? 7, 7 p.m. 7 p.m.? Boys are gonna put some OT in then. Text me your number on water. Okay. Just water? If you win this, Craig, you no longer get the money. I didn't take less money. Ah, uh, yeah, you did. I thought uh, somebody took a hundred out of the ATM. Sam did. Sam. Don't put it on me. You took the hundred out of the ATM? Yeah, for his last challenge. You just you have carte blanche on the account now? You told me to take it out. Oh, okay. My apology. Save her that, Sam. What are we doing? Water. Let's go. Text me your number. Text me your number. In your mind, you guys can play along. This is a region where they all leak. It's a high water table, doesn't necessarily, and this guy, if you look. Hey, let me just throw this out here to mess you up. Look how high he is. It's probably the, the highest house right here on this whole block. Huh? You're in turmoil now trying to figure it out. Everybody get their numbers in? Who said zero? Wait, wait. I didn't say my number. 
quarter inch. Damn. What do you got? Three quarters of an inch. I said two inches. 1.25. Four? Four. Four. Sammy's got four. The burner would Sam be shut down sleep. right now if it were four. <laughs> Sam don't want a wheelbarrow. Yeah. <laughs> so you have the lowest? Yeah. I actually think it's going to be zero. Yeah, so we're high here. He has B drive system inside in here, though. Oh, that means he's got water. What do you say? He's got a B drive system. That's the drainage around the perimeter of the foundation. Give me one inch. Give me. For a hundred dollars, ladies and gentlemen, to be paid today. Damn, don't, don't mess can up. you feel the drama? Sam, splash it like. Smoke. Where's it? Where's Drop it. Yeah, it's big splash, it. big splash. Put it down and a big one splash. spin, one little spin. Bring oh, it up. Two. Drum roll. Hello. Come on, baby. Too much drama. Pull it up. It's zero. He's not zero. Showing. Zero. One closer to Craig. Oh, Good to be me. Now we gotta get that no, truck up here. It's good to be me. Let's get this truck up here. Okay, boss. No. Oh, because yeah. it's not done that water. Shoot. This will be my it, it ain't getting up, man. It ain't getting up. Hundred dollar challenge, don't get up. Yeah, it's not gonna get up, I'll drive. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, uh, we're gonna watch this fiasco now. Oh, I can't get it up there. Okay, I was very surprised by that. I was, I was wrong. I'm getting soft. Okay, this is going to be the first rain we've had in 11 weeks, so the girls are setting up a tent. They get a little rusty. Uh, it's 2022, you can't talk like that. I can't say that one. Yeah, uh, I go, I go as him. The girls will be offended. I go him. Ladies, my apology. I'm 60. I'm old school. You know, that's just like today when you teach with your kids. Back in the day, we taught out of fear. Didn't you teach out of fear? No. Oh, okay. Yeah, we were totally brought up by fear. Yeah, you, you got to be afraid of something. You well, it looks like we're not going to need Max. Based on my driving ability. Yeah. And a hundred dollar challenge. Could you be having a better day? All <laughs> right. Man, we're gonna go get play. Home. That's our new objective. What? Get home, don't get pulled over by DOT. Oh, no. DOT, yeah, keep, we saw DOT keep keep it getting all set up here. So now we gotta drive 10 miles out of our way. Because we run in fear. We can't go. We run in, we run in fear. We need that hour and a half problem. Yeah. Look at Mikey, he's still cleaning the tanks. All right, so they're going to pick it up. We're going to use the suction cups, right, guys? Yeah, I'm on the yeah. side. Okay, this is Shut exciting. Shot a side this time. Just, uh... All right, we'll pull that out, set up those cups, and yeah, they were... show you that. Go, yeah, go a little lower. Cause why don't you do the center of the tank? That would probably be better. I'm just ergonomics, Craig. I'm just going to... Just put that on, and you pump it a couple of times. It's magic. Just pump it. Okay, no, neither of you two can put it in the center. Pull the tape, you're two inches off. You were an inch and a quarter off. Drive it. That was impressive. All right. Ready? Mike, can't you do that at the shop? No. I had a hard day yesterday. You're on my time now. You had a hard day yesterday? Pretty yeah. tough. You guys were back at 10, right? 10.30, we were at McDonald's. We, we, we drove three hours and 15 minutes. Back, back I mean, roads. We're yeah, still back we, at 12.30. We set up yesterday. We, we helped the team. Yeah, you did. Big time. Up. Big time. 
Sam knows what we were doing here, right? Well, Sam is just, Sam beats to his own drum. And you know that bottom part too. I just, I wonder, you know, you know, it's like Nate when he walks around. Yeah. You always say to yourself, what's, what's he thinking? What's going on in his head? Same mom's thing with Sam. Right she, mom's going to be mad. Nate okay, face. Jammer. You ready? We're giving you the easy one. <laughs> what's that? What's that? <laughs> the backup ladder part. Shouldn't we do this on the... Is this actually uh, content? I mean, is this interesting? This is all we got. One. We're tank guys. Two. That phone is always going backwards up that hill. Come on. Everybody tell me how easy they're working. Again, praise your father. I feel like I'm doing everything. I'm doing nothing. You didn't do anything? No. Tell us what I'm doing. Guys, this is the fastest I've ever seen you carry a tank. Craig, you're not even doing it. There's always one, man. He's mad because he lost the challenge. Oh, it's so much harder. It was easy, right? Yes. We get the electric ones? I want to get the electric ones. You want to get it? I do. Because somebody commented that we should be doing two on this side, two on that side. He is correct, but when the suction's let go, we damage the legs. Okay, I've, I've stretched this content out as much as I could. Yeah, I got you. Hey, lay some plastic out here. I don't know, it looks to me like the tent's in the way now. Just saying. Any AC work? No. Oh, you did it? Tried it. Oh, cool, I will. I'll check it out. If you can move that just a tiny bit. All right, right here, Cor. to get close to this pad here so and I couldn't sit over there because they were complaining that I was in their way so I hate to do it this way so I'll, I'll dig up the end cap here so I can kind of get my wiggle strength from the side there's the copper right there undamaged so we'll trench over tie into those Corey's gonna clean it up so we can get a sawzall on it and do our thing hopefully they'll get that in place so we can transfer right from the tank to the above ground. Because then that eliminates the step of having to go from the tank into our holding tank and then into the above ground. We're like a fine oiled machine out here. Craig's staying nice and dry. Yeah, bro. Using that special made tool. Yes, sir. Nice, easy job. Mikey's doing some last minute painting. Cut down on the oxidation. We're firing on all cylinders right now, boys. Oh, come on. And this may be one of the first times we don't get a leaker up here, huh? Yeah, I've had one. You did have one? I've had one. Oh. Me and Sam did the job. Really? Yep. Yes. Removal install. Removal. Oh. All right. Leveling it. That's pretty good right there. Very nice. Hair A little off. work on that one. Yep. 
Well, actually, that's where it's got to be pitched to the left side. Where the yeah. So actually, that would have to go down a hair. Good job, boys. Corey, Sam, somebody want to open that? See, he should be powered down right here. Throttle's too high. No. All right, we ran the hose down. Sammy is manning the end of it. Tank is full. Scully. Sight gauge, vent alarm, two inch plug, two line, three eighths duplex. This thing should be almost empty except for the sludge. Ooh, there's still a lot in there. Try to get out as much as we can because we have to bucket that. We've ever got the bucket job today, not so good. I was not prepared. I had a little bit of pressure in there. So we got a little clean up there in the trailer to do. Uh, inspector will be here in an hour, so we're doing well. We just got quite a bit to bucket. All right, Mike is suited up. Let's see. There's that safety harness right there to collect them. We'll put the other piece onto the bucket and get it prepared. Greg, that safety harness. It's right there. Come on, dude. I right brought it up, bro. Oh, there it is. My bad, Cor. My bad, brother. No more Ain't got to yell at the old man. Corey will hook that up. Where did it happen? Right up top. Nope. Yep, there you go. I did that one time <laughs> while I was filming. I feel like an idiot. Okay. Mikey's going in. How many buckets? Quite a few. Let's do another $100 challenge. Because I don't collect 100 so we got 100 available. We're just giving money away. Corey's going to look right now. Look at him studying. Huh. Hey, we're going to do a $100 bucket challenge. Craig, we're going to make you earn this, Craig. What do you think? We're going to start slowing up six months into the year? Six. Come on, man. Where are we at? Nine. Are you serious? Yeah. January, February, March. Well, May, June, July, August. Oh, my God. Where is the time going? No, this is eight. Sam. We're almost. Bucket challenge, let's go, brother. <laughs> Corey, what'd you come up with? Don't tell me, don't tell me. No. Alright, we're gonna go look. We'll let you see too. How'd you do on the water? I won. Creeping up on Craig again. Three back, I got three shots. Uh, I'm, it could be more than that. I'm not sure. Have it written down though. Went in. <laughs> my, my number like just comes to me immediately. What's your number? All right, Sam's going in. I think Sam and Corey are tied. They're Sam fighting for third. He's got one ahead of me. Oh, okay. Sam's in third. He's on the podium. So Sam, I love you, but I got you this one. Corey was studying. He was dipping his finger in and everything. Tasting it. Here, you guys are overthinking it. Look at Craig, this means everything to him. <laughs> Come on, text me. Mikey, you don't have to. So just the three of you text. 
And I'm gonna whisper mine to Craig so you know I'm not cheating off of Mike when I hear Mike's. Four and a half. Well, you heard me? No, that's what I said. You heard me then? Yes. No, that's what he said, four and a half. He wanted. He said, Mike said it? What'd you say? Two. I said four and a half. I said four and a half. Oh. I don't know, bro. Listen, this, don't get down on the second place guy. What'd you say? 3.8. Oh, I was going to say four, but I said, let me go heavy. What'd you get? Three. Three? Yeah, say it with a smile. We're doing half buckets here. No half buckets. Oh, no. We we already. You said three. Wow, that's a good guess. Well, I'll go back to four. It doesn't matter. I'm the high guy. I'm tied with Corey. All right, let's do this. Fill them up, Mikey. <laughs> what is this exciting? I think the homeowner thinks we're weird out here with the camera. Got money flying all over the place. Challenges. Sam Stiles, all that. Yeah, weird. <laughs> Mike, you said two? Dude, if you don't get it. He's not, it's not two. Yeah, what's he thinking? The guy does it every day. I was gonna say four, but then I said, you know, you guys kept looking at it, so. All right, the votes are in. There goes bucket one. Did all that? So now according to Mike, it's done after this one. Are you seriously gonna beat me by a point, something? No, he, Mike is confident he's got it right here. No, I don't. But I need it to be a whole nother one. Sam. Mikey needs to be two and a half to tie with it. As long as it ain't Craig, I'm fine. That's messed up. I'm, well, uh, you know, trying to win. You could still go take a hundred. I don't care about the money. I like the money. Right, well, you know, if I made two hundred thousand a year, I wouldn't oh. care either. One more bucket. One and then change, right? No. What? We're... Oh, Seriously? Damn it! What is it? Quarter of a buck. So, two, so it's two, two and a quarter. Yeah, Mikey won. Mikey, you should win this. Mommy's gonna be so proud, bro. She's clapping right now on the couch. You better find some more oil in there. Whoa. We ain't nowhere near your number. Could be over a half a bucket. You never know. Half a bucket. Over half a bucket is jammer. Under half a bucket. Uh-oh, Sam. <laughs> this is why it's no half bucket. Well, it's always half bucket. So now in the no. future, you yeah, we determine this at the Atrium Theater. Remember? I did point eight five. I did point eight five. Yeah, you were the one that won, though. Yeah, you were That's out. two. You won. Three. That's two. That's Two. That yeah, looks a little, a little light wow. to me. No, that's right. I don't know, bro. Are we gonna have to measure? Are we gonna take a measurement on this? What did you guys say at home? I think Sam's got this one. Really? You're relinquishing I think Sam's got it. the win? Wait, what's Sam say? Three. Said three and a half. He said no half buckets, so he said, no he half said buckets, three. That means he's not using a half bucket. Mike, one full bucket, I win. And then and then sludge. You, <laughs> you know, if you guys ever like work for somebody else, you would love what you've got going on here right now. What? Mike found another gallon. What? <laughs> I think we got a faucet. He's got a lot left down there. Ah, well. You can't win them all. You can only be the best. Well, sure enough. Show me, Mike. Okay, look at your finger. That's a hole. Water purging in. We are still 100% in this area. So that's gonna fail. We're gonna call that in. We got the truck up here now. Didn't even need to.
Okay, so I mean, you can see all the contamination outside. The bottom is wet. If we cleaned it, you'd probably see a bunch of holes, but this is that one hole right there that you saw the water coming through with Mike. Yeah, there's one right there in the end cap. You can see all the gray right there. Okay, inspector just left. She failed it, so I am going to backfill this overburden. We're leaving these lines. Can you shut that off for me? Copyright. I'm going to keep these lines above ground so I don't hit it when I do the remediation. I'll backfill this. I'm going to take that topsoil and put it, stockpile it right where uh, the machine is. And we'll save it because when I do the remediation, I'm going to sit right here, right where Sammy is. And I'm going to dig right into the back of the mason dumps to send them on their way. And that's it. So we'll put it on time lapse now and we'll backfill. Just finished backfilling. Uh, I just wanted to get a slope up against the foundation to keep water away. So if it pockets, it'll pocket right here. We're gonna put all the topsoil right there. Things on the on the verge of flipping. This final sweep up I told them this is gonna be about a 30 to 60 ton remediation we'll have to do it in mason dumps topsoils covered there doesn't look that great but it's it's prepared for a remediation he does not have good insurance coverage so He's moving forward with it. He actually already signed and gave me a deposit. So you'll see us back out here. But that is another fine job by Tank Masters Environmental.